So we've developed a technology that allows us to choose specific organic pollutants in the environment and measure them using an electrode, which means we have an electrode on a stick that we can put into the body of water and get an accurate measurement of how much organic material is in there. We're working on detecting PFAS at ultra trace levels using electrochemical methods, specifically electrodes coated with some sort of detector and molecular acceptor that we can then deploy into municipal water systems to be able to supply accurate PFAS readings to the everyday person. This research is able to solve the environment issue, especially toxic chemicals such as PFAS, which is a polyphenol alkyl substrate in drinking water. So the toxic chemicals among PFAS are regulated by EPA due to the public health. So the question is how to detect and analyze the low concentration of toxic chemical in water. So our research is focusing highly sensitive chemical detection in aqueous phase and cost-effective technology development. You have time-consuming technologies for PFAS detection. So you have a typical analytical chemistry techniques that, that literally take an hour or more maybe more than 24 hours sometimes to detect PFAS concentration. This technology what we are projecting to develop and make it commercial is, is actually like has a fast response. It's like a sensor, like a portable sensor. So when you take this portable sensor to any nearby uh, river streams and you put this sensor and you give it some time like 10 seconds or maybe more, less than that, it gives you the number that will give you a projection of what concentration of PFAS is existing in that water stream. So the money that we're going to use from TAF is going to help us see our dream of actually producing a marketable product. So we have the technology, we've been playing around with these electrodes and we get them to work very nicely, but now we need to take them and go the next step so that it's easily usable by a consumer, that a person can buy a kit, use the electrode and get a value that is accurate and um, reproducible. So the reason we applied and then excited with TAF funding is because we are not just investing this funding for the fundamental science, we want to utilize this funding for uh, more practical application like the commercialization and connect with the industry. Because there's no way to accurately read PFAS at the level we're regulating, specifically down to ultra trace parts per trillion, I would like to be able to develop a technology that people could put in their own house or their municipal system could put in there so that people know they have truly safe and purified drinking water.